Okay, so this is a quick video to show you how to use our spreadsheet templates. Now we have a bunch of spreadsheet templates available with Phantom Buster and they're all doing different things, but they all work in roughly the same way. So regardless of whatever template you're using, you can follow this tutorial. The first thing you're gonna to need to do with any of them is make a copy for yourself by clicking right here. As you can see, the template I'm using is Grow Your Network on LinkedIn. And all of our templates are gonna look something like this. Before we begin, there are two cells that you need to be particularly aware of. The first is a yellow cell, which is where you're going to give the URL of your output CSV from the relevant phantom. And the next cell is a green cell, which you'll see in a little bit, which is going to give you an input to use for another phantom. So in this section, you can see the steps that we're going to follow in the phantoms that you need. And the first phantom we need is LinkedIn search export. So let's go to the phantom store and find it. Hit use this phantom. You're going to give it your session cookie. Then you need to give it a search input. Now I've already performed the search that I want on LinkedIn. So I'm going to copy the URL and paste it right here. And then I'm going to ask the phantom just to get 10 results from this launch for me to save a little bit of time. You can of course get more and hit launch. So what the search export phantom is going to do is it's going to collect each of those results from my search that you saw and extract them into an output spreadsheet for you with a little bit of their basic information. And once it's done that, it's going to give you your files over here. So we're going to copy the link for the CSV and go back to our template. Then, as I said, yellow cell, you're going to paste it in the relevant cell right here. And as you'll see, my results have appeared over here. What else has appeared is a green cell. So this is going to be used as our input for Network Booster. But before we do that, you need to make sure that your spreadsheet is publicly accessible. So you do that by clicking up here on Share, hit Get Shareable Link, and that will cause the spreadsheet to be accessible. Then you're going to copy this green cell right here, and then we're going to head back to the Phantom Store and use Network Booster, which is conveniently right here. Again, give it your session cookie, paste your spreadsheet URL. Now what this phantom is going to do is send connection requests to the people in your spreadsheet. So you can personalize a little message here if you like. I'm just gonna remove that for now. If you hit advanced settings, you can tell the phantom how many invites to send per launch. So for the purposes of this tutorial to keep it short, I'm just gonna say two. Now this next section is very important because it's where you schedule your repeated launches. If you go back to your spreadsheet, you'll see that here in launch settings, there are recommendations for each of the phantoms. Network Booster says six launches per day, 10 requests per launch. So that's how I'm gonna do by clicking repeatedly and six times per day and save. And then I'm gonna hit launch. Now, the reason that these repeated launches are important is that your spreadsheet is going to update automatically each time your phantom launches because you have given it your output spreadsheet. So because the template is dynamic, you want the phantoms to be running continuously so that you can, as you continue sending your connection requests, you can continue having your information all gathered in this spreadsheet. What's great about Phantom Buster is that because it runs from the cloud, regardless of whether your browser is open or your computer is on, the phantoms will continue to run in the background as you have set them up to run automatically. So you don't need to worry about them. And as well as that, what's important to say about the template is that it will continue to refresh your results every two hours. So it will be continually updated as well. And again, once Network Booster has finished launching, you're gonna do the same thing, copy link to the output CSV and go back to your template, paste it in the relevant box. And there you go. As you can see, it'll automatically update with which invitations have been sent. You've also got different tabs down here. And if you click on Network Booster, you'll be able to see who your invitations have been sent to in a little more detail. So our last step is to use Contacts Extractor. And as you can see here, we'll check before we go, 
three launches per day, 30 contacts. So we're going to go back to our store and find contacts extractor. I'm gonna give it our session cookie. We're just gonna ask for 30. Recently added is what we want. Hit save. And again, we're gonna set it to launch thrice per day. So what contacts extractor is going to do is it is going to extract all of your 30 most recent contacts as you've asked it to. And what's handy about that is that once we have this information, we can paste it into our spreadsheet. And as it's continuing to extract the most recent contacts, because you've set it up to launch three times per day, it will extract those that have accepted your request. And you'll be able to see right here who has and who hasn't from those invitations that you've sent. So do the same thing. Let's copy the link, paste it into our box and as you can see my requests haven't been accepted just yet because they've just been sent but you'll be able to see these contacts all right down here and of course if you go back to your master spreadsheet this will continue to update as more invitations are sent and more invitations are accepted and what's really handy right here is that you can see your little funnel, you can see all of the results you've provided, how many requests have been sent, and your acceptance rate, which is super handy. You've got some more instructions down here as well. And that's everything that you need to know for how to use our different templates on Phantom Buster. So have fun. <laughs>